Visit the Weigland Sculpture Park. As mentioned before, the Weigland Sculpture Park is one of the most popular attractions in Oslo. It's a large park that's filled with more than 200 sculptures by Gustav Weigland. The park is open year-round and is free to visit. Explore the Akershus Fortress and Castle. The Akershus Fortress and Castle is a medieval castle that has a long and fascinating history. Visitors can take a guided tour to learn more about the castle's past, and the grounds are also open for exploration. Check out the Norwegian Opera and Ballet House. The Norwegian Opera and Ballet House is a modern building that is home to two world-class performing arts organizations. Visitors can take a tour of the building, enjoy a meal at the restaurant, or attend a performance. Visit the National Gallery and see Edvard Munch's The Scream. The National Gallery is a must-visit for art lovers, as it is home to an extensive collection of Norwegian and international art. The highlight of the collection is undoubtedly, The Scream, by Edvard Munch, which is one of the most iconic artworks of all time. Wander through the historic neighborhoods of Oslo, such as Gamla Oslo and Grunerlaka. Oslo is a city with a rich history, and there are several neighborhoods that are well worth exploring. Gamla Oslo is the oldest part of the city and is home to several historic landmarks, while Grunerlaka is a trendy neighborhood that is filled with cafes, restaurants, and shops. Take a boat tour of the Oslofjord. The Oslofjord is a beautiful body of water that is surrounded by picturesque landscapes. Taking a boat tour is a great way to see the fjord and get a sense of the natural beauty of the area. Visit the Viking Ship Museum and see Viking longboats. The Viking Ship Museum is a museum that is dedicated to the Viking Age, which was a period of great cultural and technological advancement in Norway. The museum houses several Viking longboats that have been meticulously preserved. Check out the Munch Museum and see more works by Edvard Munch. The Munch Museum is a museum that is dedicated to the life and work of Edvard Munch. In addition to, The Scream, the museum houses several other iconic works by the artist. Go skiing or snowboarding at Trivan Ski Resort. Trivan Ski Resort is one of the most popular ski resorts in Norway, and it's located just a short distance from Oslo. The resort offers a range of runs for skiers and snowboarders of all levels. Visit the Holman Collins Ski Museum and Tower, and see the views. The Holman Collins Ski Museum and Tower is a museum that is dedicated to the history of skiing in Norway. Visitors can take a tour of the museum and then take an elevator to the top of the tower for panoramic views of Oslo. Visit the Khan Tiki Museum and see the raft. The Khan Tiki Museum is a museum that is dedicated to the famous Khan Tiki expedition, which was led by Norwegian explorer Thor Heyerdahl. The museum houses the raft that Heyerdahl used to cross the Pacific Ocean. Explore the Oslo City Hall and see the art. The Oslo City Hall is a beautiful building that is home to several works of art, including frescoes by Henrik Sorensen and sculptures by Per Pal Storm. Visit the Nobel Peace Center and learn about Nobel Prize winners. The Nobel Peace Center is a museum that is dedicated to the Nobel Peace Prize and the 